Hi, how are you doing today? Uh, we will continue with the immigration uh, programs to uh, Canada. As you know, Canada is a welcoming country and Canada is a country of multiculturalism. There is a lot of people here are immigrated or born outside of Canada. Almost 25% of the population now are born outside of Canada, which is a huge number, okay? Uh, country uh, Canada is a country depending on immigrants in many things, usually labor and, and uh, new new city, building new cities, uh, trying to bring uh, new technologies. So it's, it's very crucial in the Canadian economy. Uh, but the most important for Canadians, also the culture. So to bring your culture, to bring your uh, ideas of, of uh, your music, your, uh, your dance, um, your folk, uh, uh, stuff, so uh, food, all these things are very important. So that's why Canada started a new program called Self-Employed Person. If you go and think about it, you will think, okay, self-employed means that I work for myself. Yeah, but there's a lot in this program. So if we go to the uh, immigrate section, there is a self-employed one. Uh, this is, by the way, one of the most expensive fees you can pay for a programs it's more than 2000 2140 and the processing time is more than 50 months so it's long process time you have to understand that so let's let's go just to check the processing time uh permanent residence uh, it's uh, oh sorry not this one it's economic immigration and it's called self-employed federal 50 months as i said okay so here it is uh, again this is august 23 2023 it could change it could be more or less i don't know but this is what is now okay so what is uh, self-employed by the way there are two streams in the self-employed one is federal one is quebec i will speak about the federal one both of them are the same but the quebec one i think it, they have more uh, applications you have to do uh, so if you want to be eligible you have to have uh, 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 points but these points are not like express entry point they are easier much easier to uh, get so uh, have relevant experience in what so this relevant experience need to be three years in the past five years three four or five years of experience so if if you get more five years of experience is better but in the five years, you need at least three years in these things. It's supposed to be a cultural activities, athletics at a work class level, or being a self-employed person in cultural activities or athletes. So either you are cultural activities like a folk dancer, a musician, a, a, a songwriters, a, athletes like uh, any athletes sports or whatever okay so if you are in a world class level you have to show that you are in a world class level like you have videos you have uh, concerts uh, people know you like they will dig in that it's not that big problem but uh, or you have been a self-employed in this so you work as a self-employed in your dance studio or uh, for example you are a writer so you write books and you sell them or you are a self-employed as an editor, uh, editing books. Uh, so these are cultural things. Uh, or maybe you are having a gym where you teach people karate or, or taekwondo or whatever, or soccer or something like that. So athletes, okay? These people only. So not any self-employed. You have to be either cultural or athletes. As I said, you have to have... Uh, these are cultural activities, as I said, one year period being self-employed, one year period participating in the work class level. So these are for for uh, for uh, those people. So uh, then uh, there are several criteria, which is the experience, education, age, language ability, and ability. You have to have a language test. We'll speak about that. So your score is from hundred. You remember an express entry, a thousand two hundred. 1,200, 600 of them you're competing on and 600 for the province. So here the education can give you 25. I can show you how we can get these points. Very simple. If you have a master's degree or PhD, 
or 17 at least years in education, you have 25 degrees, uh, 25 points. If you have a bachelor, you will have 22 points. Here you go. Then, uh, sorry, then experience, 35 points. So for the 35 points, if you have two years of experience, you will have 20 points. If you have five years of experience, you will have 35 points, okay? So very simple, okay? Age, your age best is to be between 21 and 49. But again, if you are 53, you have two points, not bad, okay? So don't worry, okay? So the uh, language test, you need to have a language test and the maximum for that language test 24. You can get four or five in IELTS is good, no worries. If you have, as you see here, if you have the experience, 35, five years, and if you have, a, let's say, a bachelor, 22, you already have, what, uh, 20 and 35, 57, 57, if your age, we'll say 50, it's 8, 60, 65. Uh, in the language, if you have 12, you already have like 70 something, okay? So again, uh, here is the proficiency and here's the point. Uh, then if you have anybody's, your husband or wife have a degree here, they will have a point. If you previously worked in Canada or studied in Canada, you will have point. If you have relative in Canada, you will have five points. But the question is how many points I need to have, okay? You have to get at minimum 35 points, okay? So meet these criteria, get a minimum of 35 points after we grade you based on the five selection. So 35 points, you already get them from the experience. So that's the whole thing. So anything extra, it's good. And this is not competing. You are not competing with anybody. So you get the points just to get you in the, uh, system. If you are uh, over the 35, you are good. Okay. So let's go back and see. So this symbol, okay, again, the criteria is, let's see what are, so later on when you finish and they ask you to uh, do, you will have to get your police certificate and medical exams. This is at the end. It's mostly in every single uh, uh, immigration process. So, uh, but I want to show you uh, what are the athletes and cultural things. Um, uh, there is a place to show this is the selecting criteria, maybe back here. Uh, I can't see any things. We'll find it out, find it out, how to apply, okay, how to apply, you, have, you can apply online, that's um, very, very simple, uh, okay, so if later I can find that link showing all the, uh, all the uh, self-employed, uh, let me just try. I would like to give you that live so you can see it. Uh, immigration, Canada, uh, jobs. Uh, so again, takes me to the same page. Um, I saw it somewhere when I was reading this, but anyway, those are the most important things. So search for it. Anyway, you need to do that. So if, if you think you are in cultural field, if you are athletes field, obviously you can apply for this program. So I wish you all the best and hope to see you in Canada very soon. Bye-bye.